Hi everyone, I'm Derek Swellings, one of your assistant principals here at Steinmetz College Prep. And I'm here to introduce you to our 2021 school-wide STEAM challenge called Structuring Strucohedrons. Now before we get into it, I'm standing right now in room 201, which is one of our new, brand new STEAM labs. The wall behind me is a green screen. Pretty much the entire wall is painted green. And behind the camera are a bunch of computers that will be set up for you to do video editing, sound recording, and video recording. We'll also have some 3D printers in here also. The other new STEAM lab is downstairs on the first floor. And that will have foam cutters, vinyl cutters, a laser cutter, and a wide format printer, along with some other tools for you to create to your heart's content. And those will be ready for you whenever we do come back. But now, let's get to the challenge. So to start with your challenge, you need to pick up a kit. And here are the kits in a box, but you'll be getting a bag when you come to the school. And if you notice on your bag, there is a QR code. If you scan that QR code with your phone, it's gonna take you directly to the school's website, where you'll find links to this video and instructions on how to build your structuring strichohedron. Instructions on how to pick up your kit will be on the school's website and you'll get an email about it. So let's take a look at actually what's inside this kit. So you're going to get what are called 25 nets. And you get a set of what are called recommended nets, where you get three for each shape. And you get a set of what are called elective nets, where you get two of each of these shapes. What are the shapes? You're going to hear us talking a lot about these. The recommended ones, you get a cube, a triangular prism, a hexagonal prism, square pyramid, and a tetrahedron. You might see on all of these that there's a little QR code at the bottom. If you scan that with your phone or any other smart device, it'll take you directly to our YouTube channel with a playlist to how-to videos on how to make each one of these shapes and a couple other videos. Then, for our elective nets, these are a little bit more complicated. You get two each of these. You get a dodecahedron, an octahedron, a pentagonal pyramid, a rectangular prism, and a, a hexagonal pyramid. This one looks like the, the star on the Chicago flag. Now, all of these are not a regular type of paper. They're on a little bit heavier paper, it's called cardstock. So if you mess up with one of these, we give you five blank sheets of paper that you can transfer any of the nets onto. Instructions on how to do that are on our online instruction manual. Now let's see what else is in there. Well, you get a ruler, a pen, a roll of clear scotch tape, a bottle of white glue, and a pair of scissors you might be like, uh, yeah, these are a little small. Well, we're trying to order 1,200 pairs of scissors. Doing that isn't very easy. Remember at the beginning of the pandemic, trying to get toilet paper? It was hard to do. So this is what we have to get right now. However, this challenge is not just for you, the student. It's also for your families also. So if you have smaller children around the house, these safety scissors will be perfect to get them involved. You'll also will get a piece of 180 grit fine coarse sandpaper. What this is for is this to help the individual forms kind of stick together with the glue. So that's what you get in your kit. Instructions are again on, on our website and we cannot wait to see what you create. 